Jane Seymour. Hi. <laughs> Um, pretty good. Yeah, they just cut all my jokes before I went on, which was interesting. Wow. Corbin and I had this uh, wonderful little routine, and uh, because they ran out of time, they cut our jokes just as we were going out there. So poor Corbin ended up with half the jokes, and I ended up with half a joke, and we felt a little silly, but there you go. <laughs> That's what it feels like. Can you tell us a little bit about your new series? I'd love to. Um, it's called Dr. Quinn Medicine Woman. I play Michaela Quinn, who's a doctor from Boston, Massachusetts in 1867, who ends up going out west to Colorado Springs to become a, a doctor in that town. And it's all about how she eventually becomes accepted by the community, um, what it's like to be a, a single woman in that period, at that time, an educated woman. She um, ends up adopting three children. Uh, we deal very accurately with the history of that period with the Cheyenne Indians and um, and everything that happened and uh, I'm very excited about it. It's, it's a wonderful way that we can deal with a, a lot of issues that are very pertinent to today and um, a lot of emotional issues that people have in life and set it in, in the 1860s. So it's not a traditional Western at all. It's very unusual. So in a year when uh, morality has become a political issue, specifically morality as, as it's presented on television, Well, I think this presents the ultimate role model. Um, I think Michaela Quinn is, is an amazing woman. Um, I think basically it shows that women can be whatever they want to be and that they don't have to be masculine or put men down to, you know, to be powerful. I mean, they can really do what they want to do and, and, and make a difference uh, using everything that's feminine. Um, I think what's very important about our show is that when people get hurt, they hurt and they die. You know, we don't just go around shooting people and, uh, you, know, this, you know, another couple of extras dead. I mean, you know, we actually, we see the wounds, I tend to them, and um, sometimes I win and sometimes I lose, depending on whether I have the right medicine and, and the technique. And it's very reality, it's, 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 it's real. I think uh, there have been a lot of shows where, you know, where, especially in Westerns, where people have no, dis you know, no regard for actually what happens to the poor people that die. Uh, it's, um, it's a sort of show that the whole family can watch. I'm very proud of it. I've never done serious television before. Um, it's very hard work, and I wouldn't do it if I didn't feel it was something exceptional. I think it's, uh, it's to me, it's like making a, a movie every week or a, you know, or a major miniseries rather more than um, serious television. And we've had wonderful uh, guest stars, um, Jane Wyman, Diane Ladd, um, Willie Nelson's going to do one. Um, um, who else, Beth? Beth Sullivan is the, the creator of our show. She also created Rosie O'Neill. She's the executive producer and she created Medicine Woman. So actually, she probably has more answers to these questions than I do. Kenny Rogers, yes. <laughs> yeah. So. And then I've got a couple of other things coming out. September 23rd on USA Network, I produced my first movie called Sunstroke um, with Stephen Meadows. And it's um, a kind of really hot thriller, psychological thriller, rather like Body Heat. Very different from Medicine Woman. And then, uh, just from the sublime to the ridiculous, I played the horrible Fraulein Rottenmeier opposite Jason Robarts in Disney's Heidi, <laughs> which comes out next spring. So um, that's what I've been doing. Okay?